Hi everyone, welcome back to Sandy's Cup of Tea and today I am going, I'm getting ready for work but I'm going, normally I don't have breakfast in the morning, I have a shake or something but today I'm a little hungrier than normal so I'm going to show you guys what I norm, my normal routine in the morning besides showering and changing what I do, okay? So in a pot I have a cup of water, let me see if I get you guys closer I have a cup of water that's boiling and when it comes to a rapid boil this is what we're going to be using today let me just take it off for one second so this is what i'm going to be doing today i'm going to be, be making some cream of wheat so i don't know if you guys know about this but it's really good it's very high in iron etc okay so i'm going to be making some cream of wheat so i am using one cup of cream of wheat i'm going to use some honey i'm going to use some raisins and some coconut essence. I actually have coconut essence, but you can use vanilla essence or whatever you want. And then I'm gonna use some cinnamon, okay? So let me show you what I do. So the water in the pot, this is one cup of water in the pot and it's it came to a rapid boil. So now I'm going to, very important, you need to have your whisk on hand because when you put the cream of wheat in, it's gonna start lumping up, so you don't want that. So you stir it in very slowly and you take the whisk. This is one cup of the cream of wheat. You take the whisk, stir it in very slowly and keep whisking it, okay? And this takes like two minutes to cook, not even. So you keep whisking it slowly, otherwise it's gonna lump up and you don't want that. All right, so put it in and you keep whisking it and you do that for like two minutes until it cooks this is a two minute um, cream of wheat yeah it's two and a half minute cook time so keep it in for two like two and a half minutes because the water was boiling this is high in vitamin D calcium iron and other vitamins okay it's really good so you see how it's already starting to thick up? Look, you see how it is here already? Let me just turn the camera around so I could show you. After two and a half minutes, this is what it looks like, okay? You see how it thickens up? All right, so that's what you want. And you make sure you put the stove on low heat, okay? Don't have it on high heat once the water comes to a rapid boil. Okay, once you, the oatmeal gets like that, then you pour some milk in there. I, you, you, this has no measurement. You put as much milk as you want or as little milk as you want. Whatever milk you use, you could, it could be um, oat milk, any kind of milk, okay? I'm using the Fairlife um, whole milk. I like whole milk. All right, so this is what, you put it in as thick as you want. You put the milk in. Then you pour in your raisins. Then you put a little bit of honey, because I'm not gonna be using sugar. You turn the stove off, and you put a little bit of honey, just a little bit, you don't need a lot, okay? Unless you want it sweeter. Then I'm gonna put a little bit of the coconut essence, a couple drops, and then I'm gonna put just a little, I think this is one of one third of a teaspoon. So I'm gonna put just a little in. Okay. You put as much as you want, less as you want. You don't have to put the exact measurement. There is no specific measurement for this. You make it how you want it, okay? And you just keep stirring it. And once this is done, I'll show you what it looks like, okay? I'm actually gonna put a little more milk. Another splash. And I'm making for myself. There's gonna be extra in there, of course, but I will show you what it looks like when I, that's pretty much it. And I'll show you what, what I'm gonna do next, okay? Okay, so now my oatmeal is finished. I'm going to take a half a banana, half of the banana and peel it. I 
and then I'm gonna cut it up in the bowl with the oatmeal, okay? I'll show you what that looks like in a second. Okay. And I'm going to put a little more honey on the top. Okay. And this is what my bowl looks like. Let me show you. Okay, so this is what my cereal looks like. It has the raisin, cinnamon, essence, um, some milk, half of banana and I put a little honey on the top because we're not using any sugar but I, I like the honey you need to put some sort of sweetener in it okay so I put the honey on top and I'm gonna have that but in the meantime let me show you my other routine that I do every morning okay so before I have my breakfast I'm going to take my vitamins so this is um this is biotine it's good for collagen etc okay so in the mornings I take one of that one and then this is q10 200 milligram this is good for your heart etc okay so you take one of that and i do this every single morning then i take vitamin b one of that so this is vitamin b and then i take vitamin d okay one of that so this is what I do every morning hopefully this keeps me healthy and then I drink it with my water okay so I put it all in my mouth at the same time um, drink it with my water all right and now let me take you and we're gonna go have our breakfast okay so now we're gonna go and have our breakfast okay let me show you this is going to be my breakfast this morning. It's pretty early in the morning, so I do have time to eat my breakfast. So I'm gonna have my breakfast while I talk to you guys, okay? Okay, so let's have our breakfast. As I said, I like my oatmeal on the thicker side, but you can have it however you want. All right, so you eat it with the banana. Mm. Really good. Simple quick breakfast and this keeps me up for, to, until lunch and then for lunch you know I have something else of course so I try to eat like a salad or chicken or whatever for lunch okay nothing specific but this is so good for you and it does keep you up okay anyway guys I just wanted to let you know as I told you guys my um, family is coming home this weekend my kids so busy weekend i would try as much as i can to get some footage of that and videotape for you guys whatever we do but as you all know when my grandkids come home i try to spend much quality time with them because i don't get to see them as often as i would like and um mike and i try to spend some quality time as you guys can see outside it's so dark mike's already left for work a long time ago he leaves very early in the morning so he doesn't eat breakfast, he eats it at his job. But as I said, and you're finally gonna meet this weekend, Jessica, Chris, and Adeline, my other son-in-law and my daughter, my other daughter and my grandchild. You're finally gonna meet them this weekend. So if I don't get to um, videotape as much as, I would try, I will really try hard, but it takes a lot of time and effort and. I want to spend that quality time with the kids, you know? So even if I do take videos of it, I'm not going to post it till after they leave. Um, you guys, I just want to let you know, can you believe that next week is already Christmas? It's crazy. The time just flew. But whatever you guys do, just remember to please stay safe. Have fun. Enjoy your holidays. But at the same time, try to stay safe because this... um. COVID, I know 
I was talking to my family in Trinidad. It's pretty bad there. So if you're traveling and stuff, you wear your mask. Stay as safe as you possibly can. And um, enjoy your, your holidays, you know. Um, as I said, I'm going to eat my breakfast. I'm going to head off to work. And then I will see you guys in my next video, okay? Um, the next video, hopefully when I post it, Mike will be in it. Uh, he had to leave early for work, as I said, but, you know, it's okay. Um, I'm here, all right? So I'm not going to be drinking tea so early in the morning. I'm having my oatmeal, and that's about it, guys. See you in my next video, okay? Bye.